Welcome to Woggle Guides. In this guide, I'll explain how you can add a new contact to a group in Gmail. Let's get straight into it. I'm logged into Google and I'm in my Gmail inbox. I've already set up a contact group that I use to quickly send an email to a number of my email contacts. If you're not sure how to do this, check out the email guide shown above that explains that. Now if you want to add any additional contacts to this group, you can simply add their name to the email and they'll receive the same email. This doesn't however add that person to the contact group, so you will still need to add them manually each time you want to send an email to the group. Not to worry however, it's quick to edit and update the contact list that has already been created. But you can't do this in Gmail. In order to add a new contact to an existing contact group or distribution list, we need to visit Google Contacts. This can be found at the web address shown on screen. The link for this website is also shown in the description below. In the left hand panel of the Google Contacts site, you'll see the contact group we were just looking at. To add a new contact to this group, I'll scroll down on the main list of contacts, and you'll see that the contact we temporarily added to our email is shown in the list. If your contact has not already been added to your Google Contacts list, it is quick to add them. Check out the email guide shown above that explains how to do this. To add this person to my existing contact group, I need to firstly select them by moving my mouse over their profile picture. You'll see a checkbox appears on the left of the contact row. I'll click once into that checkbox to select it. Once done, a number of new icons have appeared at the top of the contacts group. The one we're interested in, however, is the Manage Labels icon. Clicking on that shows a list of the existing contact groups I've created in Google Contacts. I'll move my mouse to the group we were looking at earlier, and I'll click on it once to select it. A tick then appears next to that group, but we're not quite done yet. We still need to confirm that the contact we've chosen should be added to that group. And to do that, I'll click on the Apply button at the bottom of the list. Gmail then confirms that our contact has had the label Contact Group added to it. I'll now return to Gmail and I'll type our contact group name again in a blank email. You'll see that our new friend has now become a permanent member of this distribution list. I hope you find this Woggle Guide useful and learned something new. If you have, please like or subscribe for free so that you can find out when new guides are available. Thanks for watching and do look after yourself until next time.